Former councillor, mayor, and reeve for the town of Renfrew, Audra Green, was honored at a recent meeting of Renfrew Council, where she was showcased for her achievement of being the recipient of the Anne McLean Award for Outstanding Service by Women in Municipal Politics. I can't explain to you how great it is to see all these people from past experiences and, and past lives that I've done to all turn out tonight just to, to honour me. Uh, I still have not really got 100% used to the fact that I have won this award. It's uh, quite an awesome thing and uh, I think I'm more um, frightened that I'm going to do something to ruin it more than anything else. Audrey was in council when it was new for women to have that kind of a role in any political format, but she never thought of herself as a pioneer for women in politics. No, I never thought of it like that. I was too busy trying to keep ahead of the men and it was always a full, full race always ahead because um, where you would convince one that you were maybe okay, 10 more would decide, no, she's just an idiot and doesn't know what she's doing. So, so uh, I spent, concentrated all my time on trying to do the best job I could. I, I never, I, 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 when um, this award came up and people were talking about me mentoring, I said, no, I never mentored anybody. I did just the way I am. I just, I, I just, I guess I'm just a mother at heart. Outside of winning the Anne McLean Award, Audrey would say her greatest success would be getting voted in as mayor for the town of Renfrew for the first time. I think, to be honest with you, when I first won as mayor, because um, it was it uh, it was such a feeling of accomplishment, and yet it was so frightening to know that I would now have eight men that I was. Uh, looking over or whatever I was doing and trying to get them to work as a team because they didn't and they some of them were really not too happy having me being their boss they didn't like that at all so I had to learn how to deal with them I guess maybe now I can tell you sort of using reverse psychology always works. Audrey served the town of Renfrew municipal politics in some form for 36 years over her career, and I asked her what kept her motivated and involved for so long. I guess it was always because there was always one more job to do, because uh, when we first went looking for money for the industrial park from the uh, provincial government, for example, that was the big thing. And then getting industry to come and build in Renfrew, that was the big thing. And, and there was always seemed, before the next election, there was always one more thing, like building he out here. This was a very major project and remember people wanted a swimming pool and, and we just couldn't afford the swimming pool but we built this hall instead. So it's kind of nice to be holding this reception here tonight in the hall instead of a swimming pool because I don't think this meeting would have gone very well in a pool. Audrey is so much more than just a politician to so many of us in the town of Renfrew and her volunteer work exceeds the town of Renfrew and crosses over to the county. Even here at Kojiko, she gives her time to help produce our show, Medicine Man, which has showcased her for a decade. And we're happy to congratulate Audrey on this prestigious award. Reporting for Kojiko TV News here in Renfrew, I'm Richard Levoy.